hello friends welcome to my channel hope you are all doing good now in this video we will see uh, what is uh, discharge piping and what are all the components required for the discharge piping and how to draw the concept, conceptual uh, piping layout in 3d model so now uh, we will see what is discharge piping first of all uh, and the Now we can see in the picture uh, the section line coming from uh, to the coming to the pump, and it is uh, discharged from the pump. Now this is the discharge line. Now uh, the components required for the discharge line is uh, <coughs> we need a 3D spool. First of all, from the pump, uh, we need a 3D 3D spools. Uh, and then. We need to make one concentric reducer. So in uh, eccentric reducer, uh, which is usually in section line, and the concentric reducer is in uh, discharge line. And uh, we need to make one pressure assembly. That will be pressure uh, gauge or some pressure transmitters. We need to uh, make it here. Then we need to make check valve or NRV valve. That is non-return valve. So uh, that. The flow which will not allow back to the pump so we need to install check wall then again we need to make the own isolation wall that is the gate wall now this is the <coughs> components required for the discharge line now we can see um, how to model in the 3d so here we already done on the section piping before now we can make it uh, from uh, the previous curve previous class we can continue from the previous class so here here we can continue now we can make it from here zone piping so before we are making we need to make we need to set the uh, site conditions how we need to uh, route the pipeline piping and also um, we need to check the classes some other uh, uh, disciplines which will not class our piping here there is no any uh, any classes when you are uh, start piping we, you need to check the four major things that we called the principle of piping first of all we need to check the safety uh, then operations maintenance constructability and also economy we need to check those things before making the piping conceptual piping so here so I plan to make the routing. This is the discharge nozzle of the pipe. Uh, sorry, of the pump. So from here I need to route the piping. So I can make it like this, and I will go parallel to the section line. Then I will move to the this parallel vessel. Okay, this vessel. So what I do is before uh, start making piping pipe routing so i need to check the nozzle size i can make it here uh, like this the nozzle nozzle the command is q para to check the size of the component the nozzle size is 50 and uh, we need to check the nozzle of this vessel so nozzle here 150 so we need a 50 150 it is a so okay now i can click this piping now i go to the piping piping here i will make discharge piping discharge Piping. Then I will make 150 spool. Specification will be A150, and the bore is 50 mm. This is the 50 mm. Insulation, tracing, temperature. I will put none. Then I will put apply. Okay. Uh, 
Scheiß schon wieder. Now here I can select a uh, create pipe and I can write here discharge pipe. Now I can select EA on EA inspect. This for the reference, just for uh, for the example, just I'm showing you on EA specification. More it will be 50 mm. Insulation and tracing everything I will put now. And I put apply. Okay. Now <coughs> here in hierarchy you see it is come under this zone. Okay. Now I can click this branch head. Now I can click this arrow with this nozzle. So like that also you can make head. Also one more method I will show you. That will be the command show C D C O W N B R. Okay, this enter. Now here also you can make connection. Okay, now I will put head also. Head head already connected. So I put tail. Tail it is not only so I will put apply. Apply and then I click here. So head and tail connected. Now we need to start routing. Now I can show you by command method. It is the very easiest method. Also in PDMS background, okay. Now we need to make one gasket. So I put new gasket to all F connect. Okay, so I'll put 1.5 mm, that is 150 gas. Then same, I put new flange to all F connect. So I can make We'll make flange here. Just click OK. Okay. Now what I want to make is so I want to make one reducer. Now I want to make one reducer here. And uh, how I plan the routing? So I will put it here like this, and I will bring parallel to the suction pipe. Okay. So I will put one reducer. Same. Just remove flange. Put reducer. Enter. So the nozzle of the vessel is 150 mm. 150 is not available. Okay, so no problem. I just for the reference, I just change the nozzle nozzle size. Okay, no issue. Or I can put 100. Okay, 100. 100. So I can change the size of the nozzle here later because the, the component is not available. In that spec, so I don't want to change the spec, I will change the size of the nozzle. This is for the example only. So I put 3D spool, this is 50, so I put 150 amount. So CLEA clear 150. This will be made. Then <coughs> I want to make uh, the discharge line parallel to suction. So I put one elbow. Yeah, I make it elbow. elbow. Make ninety degree elbow. The direction should be direction it will face to the east so direction e. and then <coughs> I make one wallet so we need to make one uh, pressure transmitter so I will make wallet yeah I will so I can put 15 memo red wallet T oil okay yeah, yeah. And then we have 150 mm. 
then again I, I will make one elbow enter then again I will make 150 mm direction D so here you see so elbow should not touch this foundation of the pump so what we do so some seals foundation will come here so it will not disturb this one so I will make 200 ok save the work then what I do I will make one more elbow here I will put uh, next to C put next to C Sorry, 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 sorry. Uh, this is uh, the command is through ID at then click elbow become parallel to this one and I want to install one check wall NRV that is NRV what I will do <coughs> so we need to see this gap okay so what I will do I will make one NRV one flange here flange will be one more flange Flip ori, flip ori. Okay, flip ori connect. Then I will make uh, this full of three hundred. I will make five hundred more you see. And then I need to make one gasket, new gasket. To our yes, connect, I put 1.5 mm. Then I will make wall, wall. So here check wall is available. So I will check wall. And again I will make gasket 1.5 mm. Then again I will make uh, flange. That is wellness plans. So I need to make one drain here. So what I do, I will create one wallet. Yeah. I will make it for uh, 15, sorry, 20, 20 mm. So save the work. I will put it here. I will show you one command also. PDM as background. So, so, CD comp. So, like this, you can. So, what we need, we need to rotate this one. Downside, it is, it is a drain. So, we need to keep it in down. So, what I do, I will rotate 180. Then, here. Can make, you can change here also 300 then put spool then again you need to make one flange here also you can make just put your flange keep always auto connect uh, on flange create left flange ok so here you can make the spool 300 mm spool then here we can make gasket gasket greater so again we need to make wall get wall isolation wall 
so here again we need to make gas kit press it create again we need to make flange well let's flange ok so we will delete this one save click gas kit then we will go flange then let flange then then what we do <coughs> is we need to bring this one parallel to this section line so i will put elbow here i can put elbow elbow direction b here you can change direction u and here you can change through id cursor click here okay now this method also you can change and again we need to make one more elbow click here so making elbow the direction is E direction B. So put click the elbow. The direction is east. So again, go to ID cursor. Click this. Click this plant sorry nozzle. So we cannot make like that. So keep this elbow little. 300 mm back okay again you can put this elbow new elbow this through id at this one now what you do is is 100 mm and this nozzle is 150 mm so we need to change this nozzle so for this one click this nozzle go to equipment go to modify nozzle here okay now we can change this as 100 100 mm and next okay now go to save your work close this one now here you can go I'm going to discharge piping. Click here. Go to command box. Make flange. Click. Then make flange. OK. And then gasket. We need to make gasket. Make gasket here. Click. Now what we do is again we need to connect. this page okay so the command is show cd connect dr fail nozzle apply click here okay now it is connected save your work then click plan gasket now go to back connect then next connect Okay, now save your work. Next connect means keep this one uh, in hierarchy. Keep B in uh, gasket. Then uh, uh, type next connect. It will call the flange to connect with the gasket. Okay, that that is why we are using this connect. Now now we have uh, model uh, this one discharge piping. Now hope you are all doing understand uh, better in this video if you have any query if you need any video uh, in 3d model if you want any uh, anything to make model in piping related please uh, comment in a comment box uh, i will make it okay friends uh, please subscribe my channel and uh, watch and support thank you